friends subscribe this channel to learn maths easily and to get new update maths videos friends now we have to learn how to convert non linear equations into linear equations and solve simultaneously see in this case two equations are given 2 upon x minus 3 upon y is equal to 15 and second one is 8 upon x plus 5 upon y is equal to 77 in these two equations variables are added denominator means their power is minus 1 so we can say that these are not linear equations these are non linear equations but by changing variables, we can convert them in linear equations. And then we can solve simultaneously to find values of variables. See how? Now see solution. How to solve such type of problem? Let 1 upon x is equal to a and 1 upon y is equal to b. This is our assumption to change this non-linear equation into linear form. Now, substituting these values of 1 upon x as a and 1 upon y as b, in given non-linear equations of the given problem, we get first equation as 2a minus 3b is equal to 15. Now, this is linear equation. Suppose this is statement number 1. Similarly, second given equation becomes 8a plus 5b is equal to 77. Suppose this is statement number 2. Now, solve these two equations, these two linear equations simultaneously. We have to make coefficients of one of the variables same from both equations. Now, it is easy to make coefficients of variable a equal. In second equation it is 8 and first equation it is 2. That means we can multiply equation 1 by 4 to get 8a. So, multiplying equation 1 by 4 we get 4 to the 8a minus 4 to the 12b is equal to 4 into 15 that is 60. Consider this as statement number 3. Now, subtracting this equation 3 by above equation 2, we get 8a plus 5b is equal to 77 as equation number 2 as it is. With subtraction, 8a minus 12b is equal to 16, 16 equation number 3, but changing sign of each term because of subtraction. Now, 8a minus 8a, that is 0, plus 5b plus 12b, minus minus becomes plus 12. So, 5, 5 plus 12, 17b is equal to 77 minus 60. 60 becomes negative here, because of subtraction. So, 77 minus 60 becomes 17. Dividing both the sides by 17, we get b is equal to 1. Now, substituting this value of b as 1 in equation number 1, we get equation 1, 2a minus 3 into at the place of b, 1 is equal to 15. So, 2a minus 3, 1 the 3 is equal to 15. Adding both the sides, 3, we get 2a is equal to 15 plus 3, 18. Dividing both the sides by 2, we get a is equal to 2, 9, 18, so 9, a is equal to 9. Therefore, according to our assumption, 1 upon x is equal to 9, value of a. And 1 upon y is equal to 1, value of b. Therefore, by taking reciprocals, we get 
x is equal to 1 upon 9 and y is equal to 1. So friends, here we get two values, one for variable x as 1 upon 9 and one for variable y as 1. Like this, we can solve any nonlinear equation by converting it into linear form.